Hello viewers, this is English lecturer Mustafa Salim with IM Chemist. Today we are looking at some more questions from PMC test 2. So let's begin with question number 181. They have been very close friends until they quarreled over a petty issue, petty issue. In this sentence we have to find the error. So option A is correct. The tense of the verb is not correct. Question number 182. I dish English since my childhood. We have to provide the correct form of verb. Option C is correct in this case. I have been studying English since my childhood. Question number 183. Some of the books on the table dish to me. The right answer is be long. As the subject is plural, so the verb doesn't get S at the end. Question number 184. Have you dashed the examination? Have you taken the examination? With have or has, you also provide verb in third form. Either is in interrogative form, negative form. Have or has also always takes verb in third form. Question number 185. We went to the president as a last dish, as a last resort. Akhri umid. Akhri jo harba hai, usko kehte hai, is a last resort. Option B is correct for 185. 186. Mrs. Rose planning to do a course in biology next week. So the verb in this sentence is incorrect. So we have to choose the right form of verb for sentence number 186. The right answer is option B. Mrs. Rose plans to do a course in biology next week. Question number 187. There was this article about pollution in paper. So we have to choose the correct article for it. There was an article about the pollution in the paper. Option number B is correct for this one. The paper is specific, that's why we use the with it. Question number 188. Which verb is not in the present tense? So, option A is the answer. Option A is uh, she listened. Listened, you can see ED at the end, so it is in past tense, past tense not in present form. Question number 189. Choose the correct spelling of the word. The word is prettiest and the correct option is option A. P R E T T I E S T. Question number 190. Samir Dej in the park every day runs. Option B is correct. Samir runs in the park every day. Question number 191. My parents Dej near Lahore. So we have to choose the right form of verb so it is option d my parents live near lahore question number 192 sumera was surprised when her boss didn't dish the dinner they had at the restaurant option c is correct sumera was surprised when her boss didn't pay for the dinner they had at the restaurant question number 193 the two machines dish considerably one has an electric motor, the other runs on oil. The correct answer is option number C. Differ. Question number 194. Choose the correct sentence. All the sentences are almost same. The only difference is of punctuation mark. So the sentence with correct punctuation is option number B. Did you know that they are leaving the city for good? Question number 195. We dash small house in dash village in dash Netherlands. Option C is correct. We have a small house in the village in Netherlands. Question number 196. I am now going to give you 10 dash tips for running a really successful website. Is option number A. Invaluable tip. Question number 197. Choose the correct sentence. Again, we have to uh, select the sentence with correct punctuation. 
in this case option a is correct trust me i know what i am doing bilal said your car is not hard to fix option a is correct for this one question number 198 they will bake the pies which tense is used here so you we can see the word will in this sentence so it shows the sentence is in future tense question number 199 none of them dash able to solve the question the correct option is option b none of them were able to solve the question and the last question is if i had been thirsty i would have drank the lemonade without waiting for you here we have to find the error so it is in option c drain the lemonade the verb should be in third form here because we can see have in the sentence right so has or have always takes the verb in third form so that's all for today see you with another test on another day with i am chemist law office